definitely this will become zero potential. There's no rest here. Yeah. This point will become zero potential. Uh, uh, we, we can we can assume like this. Let we'll start with zero potential. Then as this is cell, so this should be ten volt. Okay, fine. So this should also be ten volt. So if we can find out the potential at A and B, we can find out the current in all the branches. So definitely two unknowns are there. So we can find out the potential that way. Now a little bit some some complications I brought it. So first applying KCL at A, summation of at node A. So this will be A minus if you want better write V A. So this will be V A minus ten by three. V A minus zero by two. V A minus V B by six equal to zero. V A one by three plus one by two plus one by six. Minus V B by six equal to ten by three. Okay, we'll get one equation from here. We'll write again at this particular point at KCL at node B. B minus V B minus ten by ten plus V B minus zero by four. Plus V B minus V A by six equal to zero. So V B one by ten, one by four, one by six, minus V A by six equal to one. So we can solve this with a single equation also. Ah, you can do it. Uh, so, what do you mean single equation? Because uh, like when we are writing for A, <clears throat> for the branch A B, we are stopping at B. Instead of that, if we go to zero volts, then ah, we you can. Oh, 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 the current in these two branches. The current in these two branches will be different. The current in these two branches okay, are sir. different. Are you getting now? That's why so I just can, picked up this then, problem. Okay, sir. We can write uh, one more extra term than like uh, from A B and to zero volts and A uh, B and going up so with the ten ohm resistor to the, the ten volt thing. That's what I did here. So the current in these two six ohm and four ohm will be different. So I'm applying KCL for this junction A. Again, this junction B has come. No? So look at that KCL at node A. So with respect to A, what happened? I should write current entering, current leaving like that. So here you see this current in these two here the current will branch no, so this current will not be equal to this current. But it I think the simple KCL we have to apply it in suitable way here. Not, nothing there, there is no any rule here. Only thing is apply KCL at a junction here. That's all he's saying. How uh, this equation will be <coughs> five by six, five by six. I think this will become VA, VA minus VB by six equal to ten by three. This equation one. Ten by twenty-four, one not one by any equation, second second equation. Or directly give value of V and V B. 
फिफ्टी बाई ट्वेंटी नाइन बी बी टू सिक्सटी बाई ट्वेंटी नाइन टू सिक्सटी बाई ट्वेंटी नाइन वी ए वी बी टू सिक्सटी बाई ट्वेंटी नाइन सर वी ए इज वन फोर्टी बाई ट्वेंटी नाइन टू सिक्सटी ना टू सिक्सटी करेक्ट ओनली सर ओके करेक्ट ओनली था ना वी ए वन फोर्टी बाई ट्वेंटी नाइन हाँ वन क्रॉस चेक कैन इट बी वी ए ग्रेटर देन टेन वोल्ट I think that this is also a better idea we must have. Can VA potentiality can it be greater than ten volt? Because this this cell is what going to energize the circuit, no? So we we should be we should also have some basic idea of our answers here. Potentiality can it be more than ten volt? Sir, eighty five by twenty two. Which one? V is eighty-five by twenty-two. V is thirty-five by eleven. Oh, only one, only one. Eighty-five by twenty-two, thirty-five by eleven. Ah, by any chances, V is greater than ten. It should not happen, no, because this is what going to energize the circuit, and the definitely the potentiality B should be less than ten. No, there's one more cross check is what you should have. I'll, I'll give one more. 